time to take the flag down. Another racially charged shooting tragedy shocked Americans nationwide last week. Unsurprisingly, the endless controversial subject of gun control is brought back to the table immediately. However, the most focused issue in the media is the American Confederate flag. Many Americans support the action of removing the Confederate flag that has been hanging in front of many Confederate states' capitals since the end of the American Civil War. After the American Civil War, private and official use of the Confederate flag has continued despite the philosophical, political, cultural, and racial controversies in the United States. The flag is a symbol of Southern ancestry and heritage, as well as a representation of a distinct and independent cultural tradition of the Southern United States from the rest of the country. For supporters, the flag represents Southern sovereignty in a past era. There has been a growing outcry across the nation for removing the flag after the incident in which nine black people were killed by a gunman with alleged white supremacist views during a prayer meeting at a church in Charleston, South Carolina. Prominent voices have joined in the call for the flag's removal, including Governor Nikki Haley. It's time to move the flag from the Capitol grounds, said Governor Haley during a press conference. All symbols of the Confederacy are rapidly disappearing from stores, websites, and public squares. Amazon has now banned all Confederate battle flag items from being sold on its site. However, the massive e-commerce site continues to allow the sale of dozens of apparel items featuring communism, so some people accuse banning Confederate flag imagery on the site as hypocrisy. The National Association for Stock Car Auto Racing that sanctions and governs multiple auto racing sports events, also stands behind the takedown action. We want everybody in this country to be a NASCAR fan, and you can't do that by being insensitive in any one area. The coming series will be aggressive in dissociating the symbol from its events, said NASCAR chairman Brian France. It is part of our country's history, so it needs to be just that, part of our history. It isn't part of our future, he added. In a 2013 poll, a 38% plurality of those polled disapproved of displaying the flag in public places. In the same poll, a 44% plurality of those asked viewed the flag as a symbol of racism, with 24% viewing it as exclusively racist, and 20% viewing it as both racist and symbolic of pride in the region.